TNG Tech fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zelot, and we're here today doing the Alpha 9 series out in space in my space hangar. And here we go, folks. The CV Miner is complete, and I have named it the Space Mole. Yes, the Space Mole. Along with its clown ass face. It sticks his tongue out at you when you get too close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I still I still think that's awesome. Okay. Um so she's ready to go. We're gonna take it out. I've stocked her up. Um she's got everything in it now in the way of what she needs to keep us alive and to keep us going for quite a while we can live on her we're gonna live on her for quite a while here as we go explore the uh the universe and strip it of all of its good resources so <laughs> i also have in my factory ready to go another hole mole and a small fighter that will fit in the hangar with the hole mole now the small fighter we probably we're gonna have to upgrade its um we're gonna have to upgrade its rockets right away but that's fine and then but we we actually have no magnesium so we can't even make rockets for it so that's the one thing we gotta go find is more magnesium we are just like we've, we've got everything but magnesium at this point in in like bucket fulls but <laughs> yeah we just i don't know we just haven't got the magnesium, so we're going to go try and find that today. Uh, we're also going to go put some generators out at another temperate planet, I think. So, yeah, let's get going. Let's get going. Come right up over here. The door's right here. Oops. I'm always sucky at this, so I'm going to go into a... Oh yeah, wow, was that a miss? There we go. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so uh you know what here I can turn I can turn my gravity my jetpack off. So give you a quick little tour if you guys haven't seen this. So this is with just the so this is my little area here, you know. <laughs> I have all the lights turned off. That's an emissive. Why it's so bright. Um, quaint little work area. We've got the hangar, which is actually quite quite large. It can hold my two vehicles, no problem. And it's got the uh, T2 repair. I think that's T2, yeah. So that's all ready to go. Got a couple of armor lockers out here. And then, so you'll notice that I've got the one advanced constructor and the two, two smalls. The two smalls are going to be doing the bulk of the ore refining for any ores that they can refine, which is pretty much everything except for Arrestrium and Zascosium. Uh, you also notice that they can do magnesium powder. So... Uh, they can do, they can also refine the pellets if we need. They can make, I believe, what can they actually make in the way of, uh, they can only make the small fuel packs, but whatever, we're, we'll use, we can use the, uh, advanced constructor to make the actual promethium fuel packs when we need them. Okay, let's go up to the garden here. So it looks like it's ready to pick. And you can see I got rid of the elevator going up through the roof because I didn't think we were actually going to need to get up there. So, And I needed the, the spot for the light. So there we go. That's all ready. Um, we've got our engine room in here. Oh, come on. And that's all ready. I think we've, we're full on. Yeah access the warp drive right there so here we go this garden should be able to keep us alive i can't see why it wouldn't 
let's connect to our, we are connected to it already. Okay, that's good. So you can see I've got my armor and the armor mods with me. So let's quickly pick this since it's ready, right? Might as well. Only makes sense. Keep our fridge all stocked up and that way we can get the um, whatever it is that we can make. We can start that process. So let's get that processing. Let's change this to the um, food. How do I get the drop down lower? Really? Okay, there, good. Uh, okay, so we'll turn that back on. And you know what? We can get some pizza going here. Let's turn that down to one. We'll get some pizza going because we've got lots of emergency rations at this point. Uh, and speaking of, yeah, I mean, yeah, see, we've got ton, a ton, a ton. Okay, well, there we go. We pick, picked our garden. And I've already uh, put ammo in this thing. We've got fuel and oxygen. We've got lots of water on us. We actually have a full cargo box full of water. Uh, we've got one stack of every type of ingot. Uh, the only thing we don't have is magnesium. We've got a bunch of promethium with us. We've got a bunch of fuel with us. We've got some taxid. Let's go. Let's go. I think we're ready to rock and roll. Um... Oh, actually, here, I want to put my armor away. I don't think... You, you can't actually do that from here, can you? So that's equipment. Armor locker. Oh, yeah, you can. Okay, that's good. Okay, let's throw that in there. There we go. There we go. We can just do that from the control panel next time. Excellent. So as we go by, we're going to flip our switch, turn everything on, climb into the cockpit. And so I have everything turned off with that switch that can be turned off that doesn't have to do with the food growing, basically, is what it comes down to. And then everything else can be turned back on through custom grouping switches. So... That way I can get it really granular and like turn everything off except for gravity or turn everything off except the miniguns, you know. I can turn everything off except, so it, it just, it just makes it super easy to control what I want. So here we go. I think we're good. Uh, we got lots of O2 right now. Let's just go. Let's just go. I'm going to get out of here. So I think we're going to warp to um, another sector. This thing handles actually quite well. So I don't need the, I don't need the drills out. So we're going to turn off the drills. We're going to turn off the multi turret. And I'll leave the guns, the sentries, the engines, all the rest of that on. Okay. Okay, so you can see the power usage is just nothing at full throttle out in space. So that's good. That's a good omen. And it handles super, super quickly with the four T2. It, it really, really goes good here. The side to side is pretty darn good. Let's take a look at the specs. Uh, wow. Is that right? That doesn't seem right. Those are phenomenal numbers. Those are like fighter jet numbers. That can't be right. But that's good because I wanted to make it feel like a fighter jet when it's empty, right? Because we need that. So that's 
I think I got it right then because that is excellent. I like these numbers, the 41 down, excellent. 4G down when it's out in space, sure. We're going to be testing all that once we get into some higher gravity atmosphere with some heavier loads. But for now, I think this thing is kicking ass. This is going to do good. It's like a, it actually totally reminds me of my uh, whole bowl. Like it, it feels, feels similar even flying it around. <laughs> I don't know why. Okay, so let's see. Let's go somewhere. Let's go. Um, so we've got this run, which is a temperate planet. I don't think it's a, I want to find a, a swamp planet. This is Eoa. It's temperate. Magnesium, yeah. We want to get there. Planet size three, not too big. Uh, it's a got. It's got higher, a little bit higher than average gravity and and about average density, really. So that's not bad. So this is a swamp planet. I can tell by the write-up and by the deposits on it. So I think we want to go over there. So let's um, should we let's kind of take a detour to it by going up to Vrun. So we're gonna we're gonna lock onto Vrun. So where's Vrun? Where's Vrun? Down here. Run. There we go. So let's head to run, and we're up to speed pretty darn quick. I like that. I like that. First warp in the mining CV. So here we are at Vrun. Well, that's really cool. So it's a regular temperate planet. So lots of water, but lots of land. So this will be like a, a, an Akua type of planet, but with real high-end, um, what's, in, what's in orbit here? A restroom. Meh. So we could go plant some, we could go plant some uh, water generators. So let's, let's do that. Where's the sun? Where's the sun? Right there. Okay, so that's probably. Yeah, let's find galactic up. So the sun was was right there. So I'm thinking the pole should be over here somewhere. We're basically going to go land really close to the pole and drop off a couple of water generators. Let's get these made, actually. Let's get these made. Have I made any yet? So we want the other one. No. We want the other one as the output. Yeah. What else have we got here? I don't think... So I've got lots of that stuff, but yeah, I don't have, I don't have any generators with me. No. Oops, some extra smaller fuel, some extra ammo, weapons. Okay, good. Good. Uh, and my meds. Okay. So that's in that cargo box. Okay, so let's make one. So let's put this into the second one, and we're going to make, uh, well, we're going to make a bunch, right? We're going to make six. Three, four, five, six, and we'll go lay those out. Okay. So, ooh, what's that? What's that? Hang on. We've got something in orbit here. which seems to be moving. 
because I don't think I'm moving. Wow, it's moving super slow. Okay, so let's stay away from that. Obviously a capital vessel of some sort. It looks like a freighter, but you never know. It could be like the drone. It could be the drone uh, carrier. So we got to be careful. Got to be careful. So where was the... Let's keep our distance from that thing. The pole should be up over here, right? Because where's the... Here, let's, let's spin the galactic up. There's galactic up. Pull should be like right here. If this is a regular tilted planet. No? Okay, I might just. I might just totally. Derp in here, like. <laughs> Shouldn't it be up here? No? No, it looks like water to me. Uh, you know what? Here, what we can do, what we can do. Power usage is really low. I like that. So let's go into the atmosphere really quick. And that'll give us... That'll orientate us. Get over the water here. Okay, so we'll come down over the water. And... We're in Talon territory, okay. Well, that's good. <laughs> well, at least I said we were for a second. Oh, it looks like a cloudy day. Okay, let's level off here. Take a look at our map. And... Okay, so let's head... Well, we just had to keep going. Wow, okay. I think I want to keep going north because, or you know what, we can put this down in Talon territory, right? Yeah. So if we go south, that's actually a pretty good idea. If we put it down in Talon territory, then um, I don't think the patrol vessel will bug us. I don't know. I could be completely wrong, though. Because, <laughs> you know, that never happens. Okay, so... You know what, let's um... Let's turn our... Sentry guns off. Because those are gonna start shooting at predators here, which I don't really need... Them to be shooting at. Okay, so I guess we could just I just want to find somewhere where it's easy gonna easy for this thing to land. land down over here. This should be fine. Oh, that's 
weird. There's a bunch of, uh... That looks weird. It looks like there's seaweed growing outside of the... It is. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, any critters? Doesn't look like it. Let's land. So how... This thing, like, flies up right now. So I think... We're going to be able to load this thing up with quite a bit. Okay. That looks good. Looks good. Okay, let's just turn the thrusters off the engines for right now. We'll keep everything else turned on. And whoops. Keep forgetting that'll break my leg if I do that. So let's uh let's go through the back door. And we could actually spawn in our vehicle now, I guess. It's not that bad of an idea. I mean, as long as the patrol vessel doesn't come by, we should be okay. Yeah, okay, so we're going to do that. for. We'll finish off the episode by... Uh, we're going to drop these water containers off, and then... Um, I'm going to spawn in the, the whole mall right now and use that to go drop off the water containers because <laughs> I'm a wuss. So let's do that. Okay. And whoa, Nelly, come on. Really? There. No? Right there. No, no, here, let's, really? Oh, I can, I can do the, oh, it's going to do that, is it? <laughs> yeah, it is. Okay, screw you, I'm just going to go place the things and we're going to call it an episode then. But yeah, at least I got the whole mole placed, so now I can, um, I can, I can always, spawn the small vessel out in space because that doesn't matter i can dock that to the uh, cv out in space but the whole mole i can't i have to dock it down here in the atmosphere well i could dock it out in space it's just a pain yeah look at that it is growing up outside of the that's trippy this is a trippy planet okay okay it's all really cloudy, foggy. It's kind of a weird color, hazy. It almost seems like a swamp planet, but it's not. Okay, well, uh, do we have these ready to go? They should be done by now. Yep. And we need some fuel. So let's grab fuel from here. Uh, do I want to put that much fuel in? Holy crap. Just keep them running forever. I have the other one too. Uh, let's do... Let's grab that. We'll use up all the small ones first. Yeah. Let's do that. Because by the time we come back, it'll be full. You know, we'll, we'll get like eight or ten stacks anyway. So, let scare the bejesus out of me. Ass face. You clown ass face. Damn it. Scaring me. Okay. I guess I could have parked a little closer. <laughs> now I'm all scared. I'm freaked out. Monster's gonna come grab me. Alright. 
get this place. Come on. Ugh. There we go. Excellent. And last one. There we go. There we go. We are golden. Whoa. Night vision in this is horrible. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Whoa, that was blinding. Uh, uh, can't see. Okay, stick your tongue out, ass face. Thank you. Swallow me now. Yum, yum, yum. You make a burping sound when, he, when it opens. Okay, guys, well... We got the whole mole. I'm going to get that docked in. And then um, next episode, we're going to continue to explore. I What what do we got on here? We've got resin. Uh, we don't have any magnesium. So I think we need to go out into space here. Or we need to go to the other one. Let's go to the other one with the magnesium. Yeah, we're going to we're going to warp over to. Eroe, Eroa, Eroa, and we're going to check that out. We're going to try and get some magnesium to uh, to put um, some better missiles into the SV that I'll be spawning in next episode. So, until then, guys, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.